Hello everyone. Now today we are going to learn how to make a simple firefighter bot. So this is a simple firefighter bot. Now before moving into its construction and programming, first of all we'll see it's working. So this is a power switch. I'll I'll power it on. Okay. So this is programmed such that it moves randomly in different direction and searches for fire. and when fire comes in front of it the this fan starts to rotate so now we are going to see its construction basically in this bot there are through two alternate leds connected this is first this one is controlling the drive motors and this is second and this is this l2 and 3d is controlling this motor through which this fan is connected this is our flame sensor this is arduino uno and we have this battery this 9 volt battery uh, which is powering up our uh, l2 and 3d or which is supplying power to our motors so in this we have a right motor connected to pin number 8 and pin number 9 of arduino uno so this is our right motor and our left motor is connected to uh, left motor is connected to pin number 10 and pin number 11 so this is 8 and 9 connected to right motors and uh, 10 and 11 connected to left motors and this is the fan motor which is connected to pin number 12 and pin number 13 so this is our fan motor the second l2 and 3d and these are wires to our fan motors So these wires are connected to pin number 12 and pin number 13 of Arduino board. And further, we have these wire for right motors and these wire for left motors. So these wire goes in left motor and another pair goes in right motor. So in this bot, basically we have two batteries. This battery, this battery set is powering up our Arduino board. See, this positive is going through a switch, and then it is. going into power pin of arduino uno this is negative and this wire is coming out from here and going into power of arduino and uh, similarly vcc and ground this is vcc this pin is vcc uh, sorry this pin is of uh, analog output from flame sensor and this pin is ground pin from flame sensor it is connected to ground of arduino and this blue one blue wire is vcc this blue wire is vcc and this is connected to uh, 5v of arduino uno so basically this completes our connection i think all the connections are made so this is the program for firefighter bot so in that we had right motors connected to pin number 8 and pin number 9 so these pins are declared as output in void setup and similarly left motor are connected to 10 and 11 and these pins are declared as output in void setup and similarly 12 and 13 to the fan motor so we had our flame sensor connected to a0 and if that a0 value becomes more than 250 okay so if it detects any flame its analog value increases so if its value gets more than 250 then our fan will turn on and similarly we must stop our motors so that it can extinguish the fire so for that we will write digital write eight comma low and similarly for right motor sorry for left motor 10 comma low and 11 comma low 
the stops are motors and else that is when no fire is detected the robot will move randomly and fan will stop to rotate so these two command stops this fan to rotate and this command moves right motor in forward direction for one second see we have given a delay of one second or thousand milliseconds and next we move our right motors sorry we move our left motors in forward direction so this command is to move right motor and this command is to move left motor in forward direction and left motor moves in forward direction for half second or 500 millisecond this delay and this delay must be different for random motion so in short when this flame sensor detects fire the fan will start to rotate and drive motors will stop else if there is no fire the fan will stop and drive motor will start its random motion so this completes the programming thank you